Welcome back to Yumper and Swole's 31 Days of Horror, presented to you by the Tay and Glove Network. Today we got an interesting one for you. We're going to look at the 2020 Canadian science fiction fantasy action horror comedy film, Psycho Gorman. Psycho Gorman is one of those movies that is completely apeshit. It has a ton of great effects, monster designs, and some hilarious dialogue. The movie was written and directed by Stephen Kotansky, who also worked and built most of the creature's looks and makeup effects, and they're totally badass. The movie centers around a girl named Mimi, played by Nita Joe's Hannah, who with her brother Luke, played by Owen Meyer, discover a glowing gem in their garden, not knowing the gem contains a banished extraterrestrial overlord. After releasing him, the overlord notices that Mimi still has a gem, which allows her to control him. This part of the movie is where the movie adds some great comedy interactions between Psycho Gorman and the kids, and it's top notch. Especially when Mimi tries to give him magazines, they have hunky boys, and he responds, But look at all the hunky boys! I do not care for hunky boys! What am I? On top of all this, a group of aliens called the Planetary Alliance find out about Psycho Gorman's escape and bow to destroy him. So cue up the fight scenes between the two and they are completely awesome and gory. Psycho Gorman is totally out there in terms of story, but most horror films are. It has some great effects and blends in some good humor. The movie totally reminded me of watching an episode of Power Rangers in the 90s, but I don't think they will fare very well against Psycho Gorman. If you haven't seen this one, check it out as it's on Shudder for Amazon Prime. And as always, thank you for watching. Check out thetanglove.com for more 31 Days of Horror, blogs, and podcasts. And we'll see you in the next one. A fucking alien.